I'm Justin Grubb. And I'm Alex Getz, and we are wildlife filmmakers. We travel the world to get up close to all sorts of incredible wildlife. Our mission is to give you an animal's eye view of their world. We are heading into one of the last true wildernesses on Earth. This West African landscape is an ancient one and iconic for its breathtaking geological wonders. This place stretches on for thousands of miles and it is easy to feel insignificant in its vastness. It is a difficult place to travel to, but we have come all this way to experience something very rare. Hey guys, I'm Justin, this is Alex. We're somewhere in Northern Namibia. Now I can't tell you exactly where because it's sort of a secret, but this is Hafni, this is our tracker. He's the best tracker in Africa, isn't that right? That's right. He's gonna help us find one of the most critically endangered animals on this continent. We meet up with our research team and head even further out into this immense wilderness. Our mission is to come face to face with the critically endangered black rhino, an animal with a spunky personality and one that I've been fascinated with my whole life. The roads are very bumpy. What roads? <laughs> After an hour or so of navigating our way across intense rocks, we have come to the end of our road. So we begin tracking these animals on foot. Black rhinos are so well adapted to living out here in the harsh desert that they are incredibly hard to track and we must use subtle clues in the environment to lead us in the right direction. We also have to be very careful about which way the winds are blowing so our natural human scent doesn't end up floating on by a wild rhino. Smell is a rhino's strongest sense, and they can pick up the scent of potential threats up to a quarter of a mile away. To increase our chances of seeing a wild rhino, we must remain downwind and very, very quiet, as rhinos also have a great sense of hearing. Through the thick brush, we spot something. We have to get the approach just right so we can get a little bit closer and check it out. We use the rocky ridge to hide our movements as we sneak around for a better look. Luckily, the wind is still blowing in our favor. Being in the presence of this rhino mother and her calf is inspiring because this mom is a survivor. In the 70s and 80s, these rhinos almost went extinct because of poaching, but because of the dedicated conservationists, these animals remain in their native habitat today, although still must face the daily threat of hunting for their horn, of which has no medicinal value. Rhino mothers are extremely protective of their young, and you can see by the way she blocks her calf. A baby rhino can walk within minutes of being born and is able to keep up with mom to avoid predators. In order to further protect the rhinos out here from poaching, the conservation team modifies their horns to decrease its value on the black market. As quickly as she appeared, she's off into the mountains with her calf. 
This encounter was only a brief moment in the hopefully long and healthy life of this female. But for us, this moment will last a lifetime. This strong mother is putting everything she can into the future of her species and is a great reminder that we need to build a better world, one where endangered species can once again roam free. <laughs>